here to talk about the relationship we have in our ideas with Integral Foundations, Integral Institute, and the Club of Budapest. We believe in a whole global holistic world and a global holistic consciousness. This world that we have created is not sustainable as it is. Not that humanity is not sustainable. The world we have created is not. Because this world is fragmented. It's kind of a jungle, a dog is dog very often. I think the world is integral. And if we start thinking integrally, we are beginning to grasp what the world is like. There is such a thing as having an integral consciousness. And that's a consciousness that's more able to perceive what there is, more able to relate to what there is. Integral means in very many different ways, means whole, means not separated, means not divided, means being one. And the key concept that always comes up is consciousness. What you do is very much a reflection of your consciousness. Now, if this is an integral world, you need an integral consciousness. What is an integral consciousness? Let me just say first what it is now. The current concept, the dominant so-called mainstream concept of consciousness is what I call the turbine theory. I think this is a very dangerous concept because it separates it off. It's my consciousness, my brain generates it. That's the way it generates it. Everybody's consciousness is separate. This kind of consciousness has come up against the problem that if the brain generates consciousness, consciousness should stop when the brain stops. It turned out that many clinical trials showing that when people are on the threshold of death and that they come back, and this near-death experience, for example, they have conscious experience where the brain, brain is flat. And there is very much contact. There's something more to it. And there is much evidence also. What you do would affect the rest of the cosmos. If you evolve your consciousness, that will evolve the consciousness of the cosmos. A small input, but in a hologram, every change in every part is reflected in every other part. It might sound like science fiction, but it is now coming from quantum physics, and you join it together with evidence. Your consciousness can be informed by this holographic consciousness in the cosmos. Therefore, you can have an integral consciousness. And with this integral consciousness, you can be part of the world. You can contribute to the world.